Welcome back to my channel, it's me Jama. So today is collab video with my beautiful girl Vina Grazia. We decided to make for you guys Valentine's Day makeup ideas. I will show you a very bold, smoky, sexy makeup look and Vina will show you angelic, natural, cute makeup look. So don't forget to go to her channel and subscribe, she's a very talented makeup artist and just so beautiful looking girl. You will love her channel. How about us? Let's get started, I will show you how to create this look. Alright guys, first I will prime my skin with correcting primer from from Stila. It cancels all my redness and evens my skin tone. For the foundation I will mix two products. It's Infallible Matte plus Stila foundation. Next I will apply Stila Maracuya Creaseless Concealer, my favorite concealer ever. I like to use like a highlighter. I will apply this under my eye, on the bridge of my nose, on my chin, on my forehead and blend this all with Beauty Blender. The next step is contouring. I will use Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Palette. For this makeup look, we're gonna do a very dramatic contouring. Starting from my hairline, I will define my cheekbone, contouring on my jawline, contouring of course on my nose. From the same pot, I will get banana color highlighter and I'm gonna apply this on the highest point of my cheekbone and on the bridge of my nose, on my forehead. Oh my god, guys, it's my most dramatic contouring in my life. So then I will all blend this out with my beauty blender. For the brow, I will use Deep Brow Pomade from Anastasia Beverly Hills. The color name is Chocolate. Basically, my brow application is very easy and simple. I apply one line on the bottom and another line on the top, creating the tail. And after that, I will fill it in and kind of create the new brow tattoo. Everybody call my brows tattoo, I don't know why. For the setting powder, I will use Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I will apply this with pressing motion, that way your under eye is not going to crease and it's going to be very nice and even. The next step is highlighter. I will use Becca Moonstone, applying this with my finger on the highest point of my cheekbone. To define the edges of my contouring, I will use this contour color from Anastasia Beverly Hills as well, but it's powder. The name is Fawn. For the eyeshadow, I will use this very cute eyeshadow palette from Tarte Tutelet Tees. First, I will apply this Heartbreaker eyeshadow to my crease, blending this from outer corner of my crease to inside. And the next, I will get this BFF color. It's kind of like purple, dark purple color. And I will apply the same way from outer corner to inside, only to the crease. It's gonna get very dramatic, but don't worry, we're gonna blend this all out. The next I will just get concealer brush with my concealer or you can use any primer with a color. And I will apply this on my lid to create just clean, nice inner corner because I need this for the next step. All right, next I will get Maybelline Gel Black Eyeliner, applying this only outer corner of my waterline. And starting from there, I will draw the wing liner. And now I will try to blend this black color to the inside, only to the middle. It should be very nice and soft transition. To define the edges and set this gel liner, I will apply black eyeshadow, so you can get any black eyeshadow. And I'm putting this on the top in the same spot and blending nicely to be make sure that it's going to be very soft and nice. This is my exciting part. I will use Urban Decay Cosmic Eyeshadow Pigment. Applying this with my finger to inner corner and slightly go creating nice transition to the black color. Before applying false lashes, I will apply mascara Marc Jacobs Velvet Black. Today I will use Velour Lashes Flopping Cool. They are very beautiful lashes I've ever seen. I decided to cover up my false lashes and I'm gonna apply liquid liner from Stila. For the contour of my lip, I will use the lipstick Lancome. The name is Bronzel. For the lip color, I will use Cashmere from Lime Crime. And for the ombre look, I will use Bite White Lip Crayon 
name is Blanc. Applying this only in the middle of my lips and kind of blending it. And I'm getting again the lip liner from Lancome to just define the outer corners. This very cute highlighter in the middle of my lips, it kind of gives you visually plumping effect. My lips looks really big, huh? Basically, we're done, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I was so excited about this collaboration. If you like this video, don't forget to thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. All products what I use on this makeup look is gonna be on my description box, so check it out. If you wanna know more about me, you can find me on Instagram and Snapchat. My 99% of my life is Instagram and Snapchat, so follow me. And now go ahead and check Venus video. I can put link in here, or you can go ahead and check on my description box. It's gonna be a link to Venus channel. And I see you guys on my next video. Bye!